Jury is seated in the controversial retrial for Vanessa Coleman. A jury initially convicted Coleman for her role in the murders of Shannon Christian and Chris Newsom. This retrial focuses only on the alleged crimes against Shannon Christian. A jury previously acquitted her of the crimes against Chris Newsom. Well, Judge John Kerry Blackwood called in hundreds of potential jurors in a Jackson courtroom. The people selected will have to travel to Knoxville for the trial. 10 News reporter Hillary Lake traveled to Jackson and joins us now with more. Hillary. That's right, Robin and John. I'm actually at the, the Madison County Courthouse right now, and uh, we're about 300 miles from Knoxville. Early this morning, court started with a pool of 500 jurors by 3 o'clock Central Time this afternoon. That number was cut down to just 18, and I will explain that number in just a moment. But first, neither the judge nor the attorneys told prospective jurors that this jury, this jury duty service is for a retrial, and they also didn't explain why the case is being retried. Now, Vanessa Coleman was in court today wearing a bright pink blouse, sporting a new hairdo. You might remember she had red hair at a Knox County hearing held last month. Defense attorneys last week asked Judge John Kerry Blackwood to allow a private stylist into the Knox County Jail to do her hair for trial. The judge approved, and that style appointment happened earlier this week. Now, back to the 12-person jury. It is made of six men and six women. Seven of those are African-American. Five are Caucasian. All of them indicated they have not not heard about the Christian Newsom murders or any of the trials. Now there are six alternates for now, two males, four females, four Caucasian, two African Americans. Only four of the alternates will join the other 12 in Knoxville for the trial. All are expected to meet on Monday to be bused to Knoxville. The two extra alternates are just in case uh, some of the other jurors miss the bus or don't show up. Otherwise, they will be released from serving on this trial. Now the trial starts Tuesday at 9 in the morning in Knoxville. And uh, the judge, Judge Blackwood, said he expects it to last about a week. And I will be there covering it. And uh, we'll, we'll bring you updates starting on Tuesday when that trial starts, guys.